Yeah, Harold Hill is, you know, the typical con man. He's trying to teach kids how to play music, and he has no idea how to. When I look at his journey, I see it kind of parallel with my own journey as a deaf person, where there's this kind of mask that's put on. You know, I turn up the charm, I amp up the humor, I layer on the sweet talk in order to get a perception of myself or a good impression of myself because that often isn't given as a deaf person. And Harold Hill, I feel like that mask, that con is something similar. I, I don't know if I'm articulating myself exactly, but I see Harold Hill and I don't see him as this con man through the entirety of the show, but I see this con and I can only imagine how terrified he actually is. He's working so hard to keep this game for so long. And when finally someone sees him for who he is, we start to see a crack in that armor. We start to see him in a more vulnerable light. And I see that parallel with my own journey and my own life as a deaf person. And so this identity development is really fascinating to see.